name is Coco Love Alcorn. Welcome to my music studio. I'm gonna show you some stuff. These are my RC505 loopers. I love these guys. Uh, here's my ukulele. This is my new friend. <laughs> this is called the Moog Studio 3 Semi-Modular Synthesizers. I don't really know how to use them, but I think we're gonna play with them today. And over here we have, ta-da! That crazy thing, we might play with that too. I've been doing music for a long time and I guess I started almost 30 years ago and I'm a singer songwriter and uh, these days I use this a lot. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> I got my start singing jazz standards and improvising and playing with lots of amazing musicians in Vancouver and I moved to Toronto in my early 20s and worked with some different people um, in singer-songwriter and pop genres and then I moved back to Vancouver and sang in a 10-piece cover band and sang at corporate parties and weddings but meanwhile I was doing some electronic projects on the side and then about 15 years ago, I started trying to mush pop and jazz and soul and folk all together. And um, it's been a really wonderful musical journey. Um, I guess maybe the last six years, I got inspired to uh, keep following that sound of mushing jazz and folk and soul all together but lyrically where I had been exploring a pretty wide array of topics like falling in love and bicycles and robots and all sorts of things I narrowed in on um, uh, writing lyrics inspired by the human spirit inspired by by uh, hope that gets us through the hard times, inspired by community, inspired by um, just the, those uplifting experiences, those uplifting thoughts and feelings that can help us. <laughs> um, and that's been a focus of mine as a songwriter and also the layering of the human human voice. Uh, I discovered this RC505 looper tool thing about six years ago and started using that to write layering my own voice and it's been an amazing amazing tool for me and it also led me to connect with the choir world. <laughs> <laughs> I, I wrote songs using a machine to try to emulate what m multiple layered human voices could do and then choir started covering my songs so choir actual humans started singing songs that I had written with my machines <laughs> to emulate humans um, but something that has always always appealed to me is improvisation. I love improvisation. And when I played at the Sweetwater Music Festival, I did a fully improvised set. Yay! <laughs> and I got to jam with Edwin, who is a new fabulous friend, and an old friend, Mark Mariash, came and played drums, and it was so much fun to improvise the whole time. Um, today, I'm going to, um, I'm going to kind of try to uh, tap into that love of improvisation uh, with this machine friend Oops. over here. So I just got this a couple of months ago and I've barely scratched the surface and basically I can spin those dials and have it generate sounds, blips and bloops. <laughs> um, I got this because I haven't been traveling as much the last couple of years and I love being inspired by by what I hear. Mostly I love to collaborate with other humans but when I'm not traveling and I don't have access to as many humans which are the ways that I can be surprised, be musically surprised while being here and uh, me being the only musician. <laughs> So um, 
yeah, I've got these loopers for layering my voice and I'm starting to explore um, semi-modular synthesizers. It's just at the very, very beginning of my journey, but I'm gonna try to dial something in, a little jam on the Moog subharmonicon, and then I'm gonna improvise with it. I'm gonna uh, vocally improvise with this thing. <laughs> this crazy robot over here and then I'll start spinning dials and see where it takes me and just um yeah there you go that's what we're gonna do today the path of exploration and um I may even get this other new thing hooked up and then I could layer my voice um this 505 that I'm very accustomed to and I love it doesn't yet communicate with that but I think this can communicate with this other new thing. So I'm gonna see if I can get those lined up. Wahoo! All right, let's improvise with the machines. Yay, for a classical music festival, of course. <laughs> All right, here we go. Do -do -do -da -da. 